Hey Nappers, and welcome back to Dante's Domain. It's that time, we are here with the Ultimate Squad Premium Pack Set. We have 8 Premium Packs coming our way, 32 Booster Packs for us to get into today. Hopefully, this box is filled with spice. I'm going to open it up, we will be back in one moment. Okay, my friends, we have turned the 8 Premium Packs into... 32 booster packs of the ultimate squad. So we've got this big fat stack, two big fat stacks of packs here for us to get through today. So hopefully we can get a little bit of the spicy cardboard on our side. And we've got, this as our kind of little box topper promo. So we've got eight copies of the King Cold Hail to the King Baby there as well. So we will put King Cold off to the side and we will jump into our first booster pack here, which is going to be the GT group in action. You've got Goku, Trunks, and Pan. So hopefully, getting through eight premium packs, we can see a lot of the awesome cards in this set. And hopefully, pull a little bit of the spice. So, sorry about that. Just readjusting where the camera is. Trunks and Trunks. Got the Colonel, Cooler, the Mechanized Planet, Android 19. With the Invasion, Hopeless Sight. That's a really cool artwork of Goku and Vegeta together. We've got Foil Common Goku. And then we've got Android 14 and 15 on the back there. So we've got a bit of the robots on the front. A bit of the Transformer action. And Piccolo to kick us off there. 18 and Supreme Kai. Goku and Nail. General Blue. We've got Bizzo. Lightning Sentence. Saiyan Nail. The Big Getty Star. Finn, and then first super rare of the opening, we've got Baby in action, the Juvenile Parasite. And I'm just throwing boxes left, right, and centre there, so we can get our hands on our first sleeve for the opening today. We've got the Baby super rare to kick things off. So next up on the front, we have Beerus Motivated Destruction. We've got the Red Ribbon Robot here. So, new leader card for the Blues. Toa, Cooler, Finn up next, Trunks. Say now, got the Piranha there. So, watch out. Make sure you don't go swimming with that guy. Won't end well. The Instant Kamehameha. We've got Cooler on watch. And then Meta Cooler. So, we've got all the Cooler action right there. So, next up... Following on from all of the cooler action, we've got the cooler pack art, and we kick things off with the spaceship there, Piccolo, cooler leader, got the colonel and the guard, Shroom and Deborah, we've got results of research, Android 15, weight on one shoulders, and foil rare pan, that's a pretty nice looking foil rare pan card, and then Putine on the back there, so, so far, We've just hit the one super rare, so hopefully, hopefully we can get some spice early as well. Quite often, we're doing like one of these videos and we have all of the spicy cardboard show up at the end. Hopefully we can get a little bit of luck at the start and then just keep it rolling. So Android 20, so now foil uncommon, which means we've got the non-foil rare on the back there. So... I've noticed in the Unison Warrior series, if you hit a foil uncommon or foil rare, that means you have a non-foil behind it. And if you hit a foil common, it means you still have a chance of pulling something spicy as the final card. So, Unison Warrior, the final set of the Unison Warrior here. So, let's see what's next. Foil common and then non-foil rare. So, very keen to see what the next series is going to be like. I'm pretty sure that I've seen that they're going to include a God Rare in the first um, set, the first release of the new series. So, here's hoping, guys. Here's hoping that we have a new God Rare Gohan to celebrate the release of the new movie, which I'm very excited about. The Biggity Star Piranha, really cool Goku there. Wearing the shades, just showing off in style there. That's a pretty awesome card. I'm going to give that one a sleeve, actually, because... You know what I'm like here at Dante's Domain. I'm all about chasing awesome cards like this. So it doesn't matter about the rarity. That is a beautiful, beautiful looking Yajat Sun Goku card there. So just leave up that foil uncommon because to be fair, we haven't had too much to celebrate so far. So we will definitely be celebrating that one. So we've got the Sun Gohan, General Blue, Gravy and Blue again, Cooler, Finn, 
Trunks Red Ribbon Insta Kamehameha Cookie Monster. That's a really nice foil rare. So we've got the Krillin there, Z Fighter. And then the non-foil Putine on the back. So cooler. It's time for you to step up. My brother, it's time for you to step up and give us something spicy. So really cool looking at Toa Alita there. We've got say now, we've got the Colonel, bit of the magic mushroom there, Android 15, Planet M2, Trunks on M2, and then here we go, super rare, the SS2 Sun Gohan. That is a very nice looking Sun Gohan super rare actually. So check out this, that is very, very cool looking. Definitely an awesome one to add to the collection. So hopefully we can see the SPR version of that show up at some point. But even the SR looks very, very nice. So let's try our best to kind of tear that pack and get into whatever this pack will unfold for us. So Sun Goku, Dende, General Blue, Trunks, bit of the Transformer, the Hopeless Sight, Saiyan now Foil Rare, which means we've got the non-Foil Rare on the back of that one. So we haven't even hit an SPR yet, guys. So the thing with premium packs is they can be a fair bit random. You can get like absolute glory or you can be absolutely roasted and punched in the face. And so far, so far, Mr. Sayson is delivering us a mighty kick to the face. Hopefully we like sell and can just like, just not be affected. But so far, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. We've been pretty affected. We've been pretty affected by old Mr. Satan's devastating kick right there. So let's see what Piccolo has for us. Fusion with Kami, the spaceship, Ribbit, because that Transformer thinks he's a frog. Red Ribbon Army, the Cookie Monster, bit of the Invasion, Bar, Foil Tien, and guys, slow start. Slow start today. So 32 booster packs means that hopefully we have a chance for redemption as we go through. So let's see, <laughs> let's see if we can pick it up. And I really like this Piccolo leader as well. Hopefully we can get the foil leader version of that would be very cool to add to the collection. Cooler, Piranha, Nail, and then Super Rare. Okay, we'll accept that one. We'll accept the Super Rare. The Androids in action, Android 17 and 18 teaming up and I've seen there's that really cool like Android um special rare where they're all in the car um sorry just absolutely choked there they're all in the car so hopefully we can actually get our hands on that one too because that would be an awesome awesome card to add to the collection so let's see we've got Prince Vergeo Fabulous Heating Android 18 Kefla Lude Blue Mickey Gabora Results Android 20 Planet, Prince Reggie, Foil Rare. This reminds me of, what it was, it's like one of the starter leaders early on. There was a lot of, um, kind of Super Saiyan Kid Goku there in some of the early sets. That's what it, what that one reminds me of. So we have Super Mirror to start things off here. The Imperial Warrior, Tien, Rildo, Nail, Tao and Metacooler. The Clash and Metacooler again, Mr. Satan, Android 20. That's a really cool looking foil common, actually. The set and forth to space. And then, okay, special rare time, guys. Finally, finally we get our hands on a little bit of spice. We've got the Super Saiyan Sun Goku. Got Pan and SS Trunks there. And sorry about the camera's focus, guys. I'm not sure what's going on. There we go. There we go. Camera in focus. Very, very nice looking special rare card to add to the collection. So definitely highlight of the opening so far. Awesome. I'm a big fan of that card as well. I, It's a probably contentious opinion to have, but I actually quite enjoyed the start of GT. Lots of those last episode. I just enjoyed like the adventure and them chilling in space and having a good time. So definitely wasn't the highlight of Dragon Ball. But um, a lot of people give it a hard time, and I thought it was still, I thought it was still quite enjoyable, quite the enjoyable experience. So we will open up this next one. We will take Android Thirteen out, and we will let him frenzy and see what is going on. Mechie Kabora, General Piranha, 
Mesa Cooler. Cool again. Oh, we said it before. Foil Piccolo Uncommon, which means there's a non-foil rare on the back. The Foil Leader Piccolo. That is a very nice pull to get. A very nice card to add to the collection there. And check out that. Check out that foil. Very, very cool card. So we'll put Piccolo in the sleeve and put him in the background with our other spice so far. And we will keep on keeping on and see what is next. So cooler there. Got the leader with the GT guys. My absolute just favorite character. Whoever, whoever that guy is, he is my favorite character. General Rildo, Feta Evolution, Sigma. Really awesome Z Fighter card there. Really nice for a rare Gohan too. And then Android 16 chilling at the back of that pack. So not too bad so far now that we've managed to get our hands on the first special rare. So see if we can manage to get anything else. Trunks and Android 8, Prince Fair G, setting forth to space, the Meta Cooler, more Meta Cooler, and then okay, SBR number two. Beerus showing up, the motivated destruction. So let me know what you think of this special rare, guys. So we have had the signature rare Beerus, which I like, love, and adore. This one looks pretty cool, actually. So pretty awesome to add another, like, really nice Beerus design and special rare into Dragon Ball Super Card Game. So we'll put Beerus to the side there and see what else there is. So two special rares so far from this opening isn't too bad at all. So Yamcha and Android 8, Mira, Mechic, Bora, General, Trunks, Cooler, Rildo, Third Evolution, Foil Rare, the Demon God Toa, preparing to fight, that's pretty cool. And then always entertaining when this happens, when you double up on the same foil and non-foil rare cards. So, that was an interesting pack rip, but we managed to get there in the end. And we have the Goku on the front, Yard Drat, Super Saiyan Goku, Android 18, our boy, our favourite character, Metacooler, Sigma, the guys training, Hopeless Sight, Foil Rare Piccolo, and Sun Goku on the back end. So, what I've seen from this set so far, I feel like the pull rates for foil rares has gone up, which is like the most random thing of all time. Like foil rares, if you're trying to put a set together, foil rares I found in the past aren't even like the most difficult thing to get. It's normally like, because there's less rares in the set, you find the foil commons are actually kind of the challenging thing or a foil uncommon, foil rare piccolo there. But I don't know, like, for even for the players, like if you're putting a deck together and you're trying to bling it out, like foil rares I thought were really balanced in their old pool race. It just seems like it's going to make the foil commons and uncommons harder to get if you're getting more foil rares. But we'll see how it plays out. If this is something that you've noticed or thought about, let me know what you actually think in the comments section below. So definitely an interesting change. It'll be interesting to see what the pull rates end up being in the next set as well, whether they're going to kind of change it or whether they're going to leave it kind of the same. So let's see what we have. We've got Mirror, Cell, and what's going on, guys? So we've hit two special rares, but, like, we're moving on. We've barely hit much at all, really. So hopefully we can turn it around. And, <laughs> okay, as we say, let's turn around. We've hit three special rares, and hitting three special rares from 32 packs is above average. So we're still a little bit light on the super rare side and apologies about the light guys. Pretty much the middle of winter where I am, the sun's like decided to show itself for like the 30 minutes that it will for the whole week. So apologies if the lighting's a little bit strange, but we've got the SS2 Kepler there, the super fusion. So pretty good actually. So I was hoping, you know, you can always hope that we was we were going to see something a little bit on the secret side. But hopefully we can at least pull a few more Super Reds or maybe even see four SPRs in this opening today. So let's see what happens. Android 19. And okay, another Super Rare. We've got the Piccolo fused with nail to keep some of our spicy pulls coming along. So we're down to about the last, I want to say about eight packs to go. 
which means we've got through about six of our eight premium packs so far. So Sun Goku times two, Finn, Lud, Kami, our boy, World Champ, Metacooler, the, I was going to say something, but we'll go with the spaceship. And I'm just going to take a moment to move some of the bulk off to the side so we have room to not have all heavy played cards. So what have we got left? So we've got six packs for us to get through. And we'll dive into the Transformer pack here and see what it has hiding for us. So we've got the Red Ribbon Robot on the front, Piccolo, the Mad Cooler, the Magic Mushroom, Trunks and Trunks again, Android 15, Instant Kamehameha, Piranha, bit of the robot, really cool looking foil Red Ribbon Army Assemble actually, that's a beautiful looking foil common, and then Android 13 on the back. So guys, final five packs. Also, let me know how your own pulls have been so far as well. Have you been lucky? Have you managed to get some good pulls? Well, let me know, especially considering that this set has been out for <laughs> everyone not in Australia for a little bit of time now, even though we were a bit delayed and a bit late to the party. So, Foil Dende, and then another Super Rare. So, we're starting to catch back up on the Super Rares in the end there. We've got the Demon God Toa, the Furious Onslaught. So we'll give Tora a sleeve and we'll dive into the set of pack arts, the final four packs for today, guys. So we've got Cooler here. And what is cooler than being cool, one might ask? Obviously, I wouldn't because I'm a professional channel. And this is not a place for humour. This is a place for pulling spicy cardboard. But theoretically, one might ask what, what is cooler than being cool. So we got Bar, General White, and then Non-Foil Piccolo Z Fighter on the back. So, final three packs. We're getting close to the end now. What can we do in the close? So we've got Piccolo, Beerus, Sun Goku, Cyclops, Colonel, Cookie Monster, Cooler, Prince Veggie, Piccolo, the Foil Rare, and then Non-Foil Rare on the back. So, three SBRs so far from this opening, and two packs left. Is that it? Is that it for today? Is going to be our question. So, second last pack, Giru, we got Finn, Android 8, Trunks, Kami, Bizu, Invasion, Piranha, Big Getty, General Blue, and Non-Foil. Non-foil Toa, final pack, and this one barely even has a tear um, thing down there, barely has the pull tab, so we managed to get there in the end, we've got Toa on the front, and we have Toa again, Cooler, General White, Cooler, Mechi Gabora, Android 19, Hopeless Light, Bar, Lightning Sentence, Kami, okay, not a bad way to finish actually, so we've hit another Super rare Sun Gohan Z Fighter. So let us do a little bit of a recap, guys. So we managed to hit some pretty good pulls today. So we did not get a secret rare in this opening from our eight premium packs, but we definitely probably went above average on our pulls. So one super rare, we've got the Kefler and we've got the GT crew for our first two SPRs. Gohan, so Piccolo there, Beerus as the other one, the foil leader, Piccolo, which was a very nice pull, so four, the foil there, five, and then, okay, we only got six super rares, which is a bit interesting, but we did manage to pull three very awesome special rare cards, so I hope you had fun today, guys, let me know what you thought of these pulls, let me know how you, you guys are going with your own openings and your own collection, but other than that, I hope you had an awesome time today, and I hope you take care, and I hope to catch you guys here next time at Dante's Domain. Farewell.